You're just some kid with a heavy stick. <laughs> Enough! Monkey King! It's good to see you, bud. <laughs> Are you ever going to get sick of living in my shadow? It's time to give back what you stole. You are such a gem. It's gonna be so satisfying killing you with your own powers. This whole mountain range to stop me! But you're scared of hurting some kid? Pathetic! Time for the hero stuff! It follows the tragic tale of a legendary warrior and how those who bring light into this world inevitably bring darkness to those they hold dear. Like light. Heroes bring warmth, hope, and friendship. The hero and the warrior were like the sun and the moon. Their light, a protective glow shining upon the world. Together, there was nothing that could stop the two of them, either in the celestial realms or on Earth. As time went on, the hero attained power beyond comprehension. As the hero's light grew, so too did his shadow, and soon, the warrior was cast in that shadow. In the darkness, the warrior was forgotten by the hero. What happened to him? The warrior? <laughs> what would you like to hear? The hero suddenly remembered his beloved friend the warrior? That they lived happily ever after? No, 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 no. What? I saw a story about a hero who got handed everything? didn't have to work for anything? And you thought you were the other guy? The second the hero got real power, he couldn't care less about his friends. That's you, bud. You know, you really are just that bit too much like him. It was you, wasn't it? In the story. Monkey King was the hero, and the warrior was you, right? Maybe you're not as dense as you look. <laughs> oh, that's a relief. I thought it was someone important. <laughs> Always the comedian. <laughs> Ooh, looking a little banged up there, Monkey King. The kid, too. Looks like our old friend, the Lady Bone Demon, really did a number on you guys. <laughs> so what? You're her puppet now? I mean, makes sense. You did always have a sidekick kind of vibe. <laughs> you know me. There's a new player in town. I'm just feeling out which one is the winning side. Kid! Two of you are such a mess. I can't imagine why the Bone Demon wants me to bring you back. I who returns you to the mortal plane. All in exchange for such a little favor. That when the time came, you would free me. Aid in my pursuit of equilibrium. But no, with the first breath of a new life, you rebelled against your fate. 
Your buddy Wukong values people by how useful they are to him. Take it from me as an expert on what happens when you get too close to the king. Look out for number one, because if you don't, no one will. Is that... Macaque? So, you got Bone Demon powers now, huh? Well, it is on brand for you to have a worse version of everyone else's powers. Wukong! What? He does! <laughs> what? You got what you wanted, didn't you? You're not gonna glow? Monologue a little bit before scurrying off to your master? Go on! The Lady Bone Demon is waiting! I couldn't care less about what the Lady Bone Demon wants. Wait! Stop! If you hurt that kid, I'll... What? Make things worse for MK? Stop! I have a plan! You! You ruined everything! I didn't do this! Well, you were not involved! Stop! It was me! Destiny cannot be undone, son. I hate to interrupt. Don't you realize you're hurting the people who care about you the most? She's completely out of control. If there's a time to go, it's now. No! May is my best friend. I'd never abandon her when she needs me. We're heroes. It's what we do. 